uh, in the next question uh, we already discussed in the uh, when we are learning the section of the solid okay the same example problem i am taking now or the, the only part which are which is remaining is the development part okay so in the question i am reading again a square pyramid base 40 mm side axis 65 mm long has its base on the hp and all the edges of the base equally inclined to the vp the, uh, all the bases are the equally inclined to the vp it is cut by a section plane perpendicular to the vp and inclined at 45 degree to the hp by setting the axis draw its section top view side view true shape of the section and draw its development of the uh, development part so uh, front view top view and side uh, and the true shape is completed now i am drawing the development part so as i did in the previous question i will draw the development of the whole solid first so for that uh, it, this is a square pyramid this is its length length okay so i will first uh, draw the slant length and now i will draw the sector of the circle after drawing that uh, after drawing this part i will uh, measure the width of the base so here you can see in the top view you are uh, getting the true shape of the base so uh, this lengths are true length but in the uh, front view ab ad and cb and cd this is now showing the true shape of the base because this line ab uh, sorry ad ab cd and cb are inclined to the x y line and whenever any line is inclined to the any plane at that plane uh, if you draw the position of the line you will not get the true shape so this line is inclined to the vp so in the vp you are getting the front view front view of that line ad so on the vp you are not getting the true shape of that line okay on the uh, opposite side you can see the line ad is parallel to the xy line in the front view so uh, so it is parallel to the horizontal plane and in the horizontal plane you are getting the top view of that line ad so it is showing you showing you the true shape of the base of the uh, that pyramid so you will measure the uh, width of the base on from the top view after measuring uh, measuring or uh, it is also given in the question also okay so you can mark the arc like this and after getting the all the points you can draw the whole uh, uh, whole development of the whole solid after doing that uh, what you have to do you have to uh, measure the uh, distance of the points 1 2 3 4 from the point o so how will you measure uh, from 1 o to 1 o to 1 it is very simple uh, you can easily uh, measure the uh, distance of the distance of the point 1 from the o and you can mark the on this length edge oa and uh, sorry oa only so but uh, these two points 2 and 4 okay how will you measure the distance of the point 2 and 4 from the o you cannot directly measure the distance uh, of these points from the o because this length edge ob and od is not the true slant edge how you can see here od and ob is perpendicular to the xy line so uh, means perpendicular to the vp so in the vp means front view of that line will not show you the true shape of that slant edge so how will you measure the uh, distance of point 2 and 4 from the o from uh, these two points you have to uh, mark it on the true slant edge okay so you have already done uh, that part 
uh, when you are drawing the front view to, uh, top view and true shape so these two point uh, two points two and four you are 